We're in Lucerne and this is the home base of Karl F. Buchrach. Although movement manufacturing happens nearby in the Swiss mountains, this is the place where Karl F. Buchrach's headquarters is and their first boutique as well. One of the unique characteristics of Karl F. Buchrach is the use of a peripheral rotor. This is a winding rotor that does not obscure the view on the movement, but it rotates around instead of atop the movement. We will be taking a closer look at the Monero Tourbillon double peripheral and we will be talking to Marcus Kaiser, Head of Products, Samir Modanovic, Head of Movement Manufacturing, and the brand CEO, Sasha Mori. That was an amazing journey the last three years. You know, First of all, we could quadruple our figures. We went from 6,000 pieces up to 25,000 pieces per year, produced and sold watches. And this is mainly thanks to our new production facility in uh, Lengnau, where we could build in 2016 a complete uh, new manufacture uh, site. And this is just amazing with uh, state-of-the-art machines. Uh, we could hire uh, many new employees and uh, we have today's state-of-the-art process, how to produce our own movements. And this is uh, very important for the brand's DNA to have our own proper in-house movements uh, with the very famous or well-known uh, peripheral technique. A very important step next to, of course, the complete new product offering from Karl F. Bucher was the global and international distribution. Today, uh, we are distributed uh, in more than 25, nearly 30 markets and with many independent retailers and uh, this is super important. Today we have uh, nearly 400 uh, point of sales and that makes us very happy and proud. And what helped really a lot also uh, to have such a great distribution was just to have the best quality in the products uh, and uh, namely because of our uh, production site which I already mentioned in length now. I think a milestone for us uh, was, of course, the, the A1000, the first movement launched in 2008 with the peripheral uh, rotor. And uh, I'm very much uh, looking forward to this year, as we could announce in Basel, uh, to have already a new baby in that field, namely the Monero Tourbillon double peripheral with this unique movement, the T3000, which was fully uh, develop engineered in-house and uh, it makes me super proud as the team was working on developing this great movement with the floating tourbillon which is very unique and uh, one of a kind in our industry. I, I would say a world first and that makes me very happy and proud but you know Bucherer is, is, is very famous for innovation and, and, and milestones in the past. You, you, you need to know that Bucherer 100 years ago uh, started to produce uh, Art Deco lady watches for, uh, for women at that time and that was very innovative. It was always very important to the Bucher family to be ahead of the times. You now the reason why we have chosen to launch the Tourbillon, the double peripheral in the Monero collection was, was, was very clear and obvious as the Monero is really the, the line helped us a lot to develop the brand strong. In the year 2010, we were selling 6,000 pieces and nearly one or two percent uh, out of that was the Monero collection. Today, with the 25,000 pieces, the Monero collection is already 20, 22 percent of the total turnover. So it has become a real signature line for, for our brand. So for me, it was obvious to have uh, this uh, amazing new movement of ours in that line, in the Monero line. It's a very classy line, elegant and um, yeah, it, it really defines and, and shows all the values uh, where not only Karl F. Bucher but also Mr. Bucher himself stands for. After the very beginning of the project, we had to decide the position of the tourbillon cage at 12 or 6 o'clock or somewhere between. The importance was to attract everyone to the tourbillon. That's why it is on 12 o'clock and not at 6. The Tourbio also acts as a second display. We decided to make running the new 3000 in a classic descent designed watch. That's why we are decided to put our new movement in the case of the Manero family. The result is a beautiful and plain classic watch, rather understated, but which does technically a great job. By analogy, the wolf in a sheep's clothing. 
It's automatic mechanical movement from Karlov Buchler, where we use the peripheral technology as we already introduced 2008. The double peripheral turbio is a mechanical automatic movement. As we know, Kalev Buchler is the leader of the peripheral technology with our automatic winding system where the rotor turns around the movement and not like the others on the top of the movement with a ball bearing in the center. So this was for us the inspiration to make a floating turbio. What does it mean? It means that we don't have bridges on both sides or one side to, to hold the cage in the case. So we are using the same technology with three ball bearings hidden between the main plate and the bridge. And this is the way how we achieve to get the floating turbio. And this is the reason why we call the movement double peripheral because we are using twice the peripheral technology in the movement. A development like this took us almost five years. Uh, it's not only to design the movement, it's also to have the movement ready for the production to approve all the different parts, all the functions and make all the tests. A development like this, we can say that everything is a challenge. So to develop a movement with two, three hundred parts and they all have to work together, there are many challenges of the production of the tolerances of the components. And of course, one of the biggest challenge at the end is always the time pressure, because one day you have to be ready. The double peripheral tubio has been fully designed and developed in-house. That means we made all the 3D calculations, uh, 2D drawings, all the programs for the machines in-house. We produce almost the most parts in-house, like main plates, bridges, gears, pins, screws, all of these components. In this movement, we have two patents. As Karlov Bucher is the leader of the peripheral technology, we have one patent on the peripheral automatic winding system, and we have one patent on the peripheral turbio cage. The T3000 is an automatic movement, which is equipped with a turbio function at 12 o'clock. For the turbio cage, we are using titanium bridges, which are lighter than usual material, and uh, a silicon escapement, and both of them helps us to increase the power reserve. We are using a stop second with a cost certificate turbio, where the client can adjust the movement exact on one second, which is really unique. Kalev Bucher is working on many different projects, so it's always a pleasure for us to be involved and have the possibility to create and develop new things. And I'm really looking forward for the next coming movement from Kalev Bucher. I mean, this is amazing. This year is our anniversary, 130 years of, of uh, this great company, and this is a huge milestone. That's also why we have a, a, a lot to, to celebrate and to have a lot of events with our partners all around the globe, uh, distributors, but also suppliers, stakeholders. We also were able, just like four, eight weeks ago, uh, to buy uh, our former distribution partner. So we have our now our own affiliate in the United States, and I'm very much looking forward to that. But also in, in Asia, especially in Greater China, the brand has a, an amazing growth rate. We will have by the end of next year, latest by Basel World next year, only 150 uh, point of sales uh, in that region. And this is super important as we are able to work with the most important retail partners in that region. So we work with Harmony, we work with Hengdeli, Prince, Oriental. So with all the key partners, we have a very close relationship. Uh, and on the top in Hong Kong, an amazing partnership with uh, company Prince. So we work with the big five uh, you have in Greater China. We work with all of them and that makes us very proud. I'm very much looking forward also to the future, especially as the future has really its foundation in the past and uh, to pay tribute to the amazing story uh, of the Bucher family, we have decided to come up with uh, a new collection, a new product line. It's not within the Monero and not within the Petravi, it's like an addition line, it's a vintage heritage line where we will introduce every year one watch or maybe even uh, two watches uh, to pay tribute and they are all always limited and will only be sold in that kind of year. And uh, year by year we will launch a new timepiece, can be man or can be woman. 
And uh, there is a nice big compact coming out next year, so you can really uh, looking forward to that.